right, you guys, welcome back to It's Benji World. And today we have another react. We are doing Public Freak Out compilation number 520. Just came out too, not too long ago on Public Freak Out videos. You know I'll leave the link in the description bar below. Um, I hope this doesn't stress me out like all the other Public Freak Outs do. Because I'm going to work and I have to be with the public. So, <laughs> we're not going to let it stress me out. We're not going to let it stress me out. I'm not going to let it stress me out. All right. When they saw you leave, is why they towed your car. They oh, saw. Okay, because I wasn't going to come back to get my car. I have no idea. They need those spaces. They, they just closed that book. They closed at three thirty. Everyone was there for the. Listen, we don't ask questions. They call us, we go get the car. Okay, so they called you, and can I, can I, can I write the name? Thank God I've never had my car towed. But I went with my sister for her car before, and they're really rude. But I, I don't know if they have to be. <laughs> wow, one time I'm, take, I'm not taking up for the employee. I don't know if they have to be, but they're assholes. Well, at least these people were. No. This is so aggravating. Why is he recording her anyway? If I did something wrong, okay, but I did nothing wrong. Nothing wrong. And and they're gonna I'll, I'll be gonna be there tomorrow with the owner, showing them the camera where my car was parked, where her was driving. And now how am I gonna take a hundred dollars from them? I don't know. Like I told you, they call us, we go get it. They don't call us, we don't go over there. That's just wrong. We don't do that with That get up at a parking lot. That is your parking lot. Exactly. Some people be wasting their breath because what can this man really do? Maybe she's just trying to get her frustration out because he's just doing his job. No, I called. It was her car. Yeah. You left your car there. We weren't gonna leave. I, what do you think I was gonna if it's something else? They came back tomorrow morning, my car was still there. Then, yes, tow my car. Yeah, exactly. Well, they need the spaces. Is all, all I like. <laughs> Why is he even engaging with her? There's no parking spots. That's a warehouse. It's a warehouse. They don't have a car. Unless they have a sale, like they did today, where they're specifically sent you an email and say, come today, we have a sale. But they're not open public and, oh, here's the parking, and we need these parkings when you're not here. That, that's not how it works. They're just a warehouse where you store the corn. And I really hope when you move my car, you didn't break anything. There's yeah, furniture. There's a glass table in the back. That's yeah. Broken. That's true. No, right now, there's no, no, no need for jokes right now. I mean, you guys. Not only that, they're gonna hear it. Why is he antagonizing? Is he antagonizing her? I'm tripping. How miserable is for a freaking customer to go buy something at your store and you tell their car? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
or car seat. You think she give a fuck? He should be in the back seat. With a booster seat. Yeah, nine one one. Yes. Are they on the way? Yes. Okay. Tell them to call. How am I gonna have him call you if you didn't give me a number? Do you have a phone number? Is nine one one on the phone? Yeah. Come on. What's your phone number? Let me see your phone. Just give me your phone number so I can get in contact. Yeah, I don't believe nothing this man is saying, and it sounds crazy, and it sounds. You just sideswiped me, lady. How did I just sideswipe you? And your car looks like it's previously already. Look at it. It's already wrecked. This is old. Only thing because you, say, you drove out of the lane how? and you sideswiped me. You could have swiped. You could have paid attention to who was in the next lane instead of driving into me. How you could have hit? Why is her stomach out? I didn't hit the gas. And why is the baby not in the booster seat <laughs> in the back? Do you think she give it out? She's already irresponsible. This is all new, right? I'm not arguing with nobody. Take a picture of her license plate and move on. I got to go to work. Just get idea that With the baby in the car? But okay. Wow. Wow. <gasps> Amazing. Mother of the Year Award. Wow. Holy. This lady is crazy. Oh my God. And then she didn't back up. She just went. What is wrong with this lady? Is she high? If this woman on drugs, you going to work with your stomach out like that? I don't even know. You're on division. You're in the. You're sitting there with no police. I'm on the phone. Lizzie just died 911 because whoever this man is, he won't give me his name. He won't give me his information. I got she the victim now. Can I get it, please? You're not the police. But you she the victim now? No, you hit me. Whenever you get into no. wrecks, you exchange information. That's the way it works. It is the way it works. Why won't you exchange your information? No. You don't need police. You just exchange information going about your day, especially if the cars aren't wrecked, like nobody's injured. Which is why we need to exchange. She ain't got no damn insurance. Where's yours? Where's yours? Where's yours? Where's yours? Where is yours? Where is yours? Where is yours? I have mine. It's I right here. I'm ready to make an exchange right now on okay, insurance wait. information. Give it to me. I will as soon as you get. You don't even need insurance information. Just take a picture of her damn life. Um, I photo ID. It ain't a trick. She on something. She on some bullshit. You, I was in my car and you distracted me and you're frustrating me. Why are you not calling me? Use your head. Call me. Same reason. She don't have no head. Use your head. Call me. 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 Use your head. Okay, well, the insurance can decide that. That's fine. They investigate these Let things. Let them do it. Let okay, them do it. well, give me your insurance. I will give you my insurance. No, obviously, that's a scheme. No, man. It's you gotta be it's doing something. the natural way things go. You get into a wreck. Call the police. You give, you exchange call information. The call I the police. I will call police. them right now. No, you didn't call them. You're I lying. didn't call them. I've been sitting here at this McDonald's for about five minutes now. I don't know why they haven't answered yes. the door. They haven't come to the drive-thru. Are you guys closed, bro? Uh, no, they're, they're switching up right now. I can't help you. I'm not going to help you. Okay, well, so you guys are closed, bro, or what? Huh? You guys are closed? No, I'm going to give me a minute. Let me see what's going on. Yeah, I've been sitting here for about five minutes. And you know what? <laughs> no service here, and I don't know what's going on. What the fuck? What are they doing? When, when stuff like that happens, I just be thinking they just lollygagging. Like, I really be thinking they just had a whole big old conversation. They're like, hee 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 hee. Oh, let's get back to work. Because one McDonald's I go to is down the street, and every so often they make it right. But they, but nine times, most of the time, it's messed up. Most of the time, it's messed up. Or the service is like, oh, we're only taking cash right now. Oh, we're, um, nobody's at the window. They took forever to. I just stopped going, and it's so close. It's so close. It sucks because it's so close. But I just stopped going there. I just stopped. What's going on with your service? What's going on with your service? Because I've been here for seven minutes and eight seconds. No, I've been in the drive-through. No one answered. You guys are acting like you're closed. You know, you got people walking around. You guys are during operation. You have operation hours, all right? Yeah. Are you open right now? Yeah. Okay, so it's eight minutes and... 
Her as an employee, all she had to say was, would you like to order? I apologize for the wait. Would you like to order? I apologize for the wait. Would you like to order? Anything he said, I apologize for the wait. Would you like to order? I apologize for the wait. Would you like to order? <laughs> that's, that's my exact, that would be my exact line. I apologize for the wait. Would you like to order? I apologize, but that, that's all it would be. Obviously, the guy that came to the window, I guess he's not, he's just a cleaner or something. Because he's not even, that's, I guess that's why he was so frazzled and stuff like that. She probably was on some bullshit. I can tell. And then you stopped taking my order. Well, I, I have a window now, right? I'm uh, eight minutes and 50 seconds. Say it, say, it, say it one more time. You could have what? You could have just ignored me. If what? So you were you were you were knowing me. You're ignoring knowing you knowingly ignored. Why are you arguing with him? Why are you, I I can't take them I can't take the employee's side on this. You just said on the court you knowingly ignored me, but you you could have continued to ignore me. I, I sat there for three minutes, bro. It's on recording. You have terrible service. So you're just in the thing or are you gonna order? Uh, so okay. can I get the management? Okay. Can I get your name and your position? No. Okay. Oh, see that? Are you gonna move out of the line or am I gonna have to call the cops? Call. See that right there? Anytime somebody asks for my name, I tell them. What, what am I gonna hold my name back for? If you describe me, they're going to know exactly who I am. Anything that I said to you, I'm not regretful that I said it. So if she knew she was in the right, she would have just gave the name. I don't give a damn. Have my name. Don't record me. I don't like that. That's that's some weird sh shit that happens. But don't, don't record me, but you can have my name all day. Have my name all day. Don't give a damn. I have, uh, I have it all recorded. Call okay, that's fine. I, Call me, please. Are you gonna order I'd like to make a report. I'll make a report about your bad service and how you're trying to trespass okay, me because you guys have terrible service. Okay. And this is going to corporate. That's fine. Can I get your name? No. <laughs> going to corporate. And can I get a manager? I am the manager. Well, that's very unprofessional. Okay, I'm sorry about that, but when working, you need one. Eight minutes and 30 okay, seconds man. out? That's not, I guarantee you, that's not how McDonald's works. Girl, I wouldn't be, damn, my ankle. I wouldn't be um, explaining anything to him. I could have continued ignoring you, but I decided not to. I like your name and your store number. My name is right on her back. So they can get your name that way. Can I get your name? Okay, then call the cops so I can get your name that way. I'm not going to give you my name regardless. Then that's fine. We'll sit here until the cops get here. Why? Because he, she should just call the cops. Call the cops. I'm telling you, you're gonna lose your job. You're gonna lose your job, dude. She's not gonna lose her job. That's one thing. That's one thing I don't like. Okay, you say I have poor customer service. You say I have this. Don't tell me I'm gonna lose my whole income, feeding my family, feeding myself because I was poor at customer service that time. Now. Am I going to be reprimanded? For sure. I'm, I'm, um, are they going to talk to me to try to improve customer service? For sure. But lose my entire income because of an, this? People are warped. They're warped in their thinking. Like, I would never want somebody to lose their job because they gave me poor customer service. I would never want anybody to lose their job. What I want the manager to speak to them, and properly train them on how to do customer service better, of course, I would want that, but lose your entire income, your livelihood? No, that's dumb. I hate when people, oh, you're gonna lose your job. Over some bullshit? Do you know how, you, you don't even know what's happened prior that day or be, before this customer or what was really going on inside. Did she handle this poor? Yes, she handled it very poor. But lose your job? I, I don't like that. Don't, don't threaten I'm going to lose my job. Because nine times out of ten, I'm not going to lose my job. They're just going to talk to me. Especially at my place, I'm not going to lose my job unless I cursed you out or something, which I'm not going to do because I'm not dumb enough to do. But anyway. I'm trying to order from your company. That's why, I, that's why I do these videos because they be thrusting me out. They be thrusting me. You put a man order, and instead of him sitting here just looking recording, then... You gotta go viral. 
Harold. That's fine. Give me your name and your store number and I'll leave. The store number is on the um, the store number. Is the store number is on Google. And your name? I'm not gonna use my name. Then uh, call the cops because I need your name. And now you're cursed. Who cares? But look, um, I can't even tell you what I would do in this situation. She should never say she was gonna call the cops because she should. Now she should just call the cops. I am a customer. I've been sitting here for now okay, 12 minutes. No, now you're harassing her, to be honest. How am I going to have proof about your terrible You're story? harassing her now. Your terrible you story? already have proof. I, I'm in public. They're both in the wrong. I'm in public, baby. I'm in public. No, you're trespassing. You're on the property. Unless I get your name, I'm not leaving. Call the cops. You're accosting me my so much, but you think I'm happy with the service? Give me your name and your store number and I'll be out of here. Who are you talking right, to? Then. then we're sitting here. Then yeah, let's chill. You know she's still getting paid, right? <laughs> You're costing me my lunch break, meaning you have to go somewhere. She's still getting paid. And is, and now that you've yelled yelled at her and harassed her, you've, you've lost your argument. You've lost it. She was in the wrong. They were in the wrong. But as soon as you took it too far and started harassing her and started yelling, you now you're in the wrong. You have no case now, unless you're gonna cut that out of the video and present it a different way to um, corporate, which is not gonna tell, a lot of people don't even do that. Well, <laughs> the petty ones do. But do you think corporate, you know what corporate does? They send an email to the manager and whatever that customer complained on, they'll just give them a $25 gift card, $10 gift card, something like that. Which a lot of times the customer just wants money anyway. And then they send an email to the manager, the manager reviews it to see if they want to talk to the manager, talk to the employee or not. If they talk to an employee, they're going to say what happened, they tell their story or whatever. Okay, please don't do that again. But depends on what type of manager, because some managers are assholes. Please don't do that again. Let's correct this. Let's get this going. You know, let's correct this and blah, blah, blah. That's it. That's all that happens. I'm going to call corporate. I'm going to call corporate. That's why a lot of time I don't waste my time calling corporate. Like, I literally talk to the manager right then and there. Or I tell the person what they're doing. Like, you know you're being rude, right? Or you know such and such, such and such, right? Like, I'm not going to... Why do I have to talk to... The, some a manager for what or why do I have to why anywho like comment subscribe tell me guys what you tell me what you guys think about this video um press that notification bell so you can get alerts for my newer videos um if you made it this far put a heart in the um in the comment section say I made it I'm kind of like spaced out because I don't want to repeat some of the same things I always repeat over and over because you know I don't really I edit my videos obviously but I don't a lot of times I don't cut out certain things because I mean it's just my personality and it's just what it is so I don't like to like really edit too too much because I don't like to edit too too much but anyway you guys have a good day bye